We've had to turn down several jobs because of whatever the message may have been, even from customers who we've worked with for years. Because I'll work with any person, no matter who they are, no matter what their belief systems are, but when they present a message that conflicts with my convictions, it's not something that I can print. That's the line for me. Passion of, of what we do at Hands On Originals is to take people's message and make it better. And so we'll try to make it more creative so that it's something that, that people are gonna pull out of the drawer and actually wear. He's very thoughtful about his faith and his work and how they interact. And he's very serious about the fact that his work is a part of his worship and his work is a part of his faith. When this first happened um, and it hit the papers. Businesses began to pull their business from us. Right and left, we were losing customers. There came a point where I was so broken. I went home, I just laid in, in bed, lights out, and began to cry out to the Lord and just say, God, I, I will stand no matter what the cost will be. Because we're the ones at the end of the day who have to print that on a shirt and it speaks a message the second it goes off the press. And for me, I'm accountable to that. I'm accountable to that first to God of what I put on a shirt to promote. But we did wrestle with the, the reality in this that we may lose our business. Very early in this case, there was a, a lesbian print shop owner in New Jersey that came out openly in support of Blaine and his right to decline to print messages that he disagreed with. People on both sides of the debate can see the virtue of allowing people the freedom to, to live consistent with their beliefs because the same precedent that would protect Blaine's beliefs is the same precedent that protects this lesbian print shop owner's freedom to decline to print messages that she disagrees with. Why would I as a business owner who, you know, our business has grown year after year, want to bring this on my company? If anything, I would want to stay as far away from that as possible. But there's a cost. There is something that calls out to me that says I've got to speak truth. This case is really about the freedom of all Americans to conduct their business consistent with their beliefs. And that protection's as good for the person of faith as it is for the atheist. It's as good for the Democrat as, as it is for the Republican. Everyone has this freedom. So we all should stand up side by side with people like Blaine, and we should defend their, their freedom and their liberty to live consistent with their